bit. Whoa. <laughs> we might have been doing some ice sliding. Oh, yeah. Push your rock a little bit? Eh? Or push your sled ahead of... But you're dragging. Yeah. Right now, see how it's lifted like that? Yeah. So now it's. You, we want to sort of flatten it, but we don't want to try to cut it too deep because you won't even be able to move it. We'll try it on the trail. If it's pulling too hard, then we'll make an adjustment. Okay. Whew, it's warm now. See how the snow piles up on the back of it? Yeah. Packs the weight on, and then that, that hardens it up overnight. That's, that's the slickest trail groomer going. Yeah, well, this, this one, right yeah, but this is what happens. It, uh, it's just, we had to cut it too hard. Yeah. So your first trip of the season, you can't cut that hard. Especially when you're busting trail. It's better to just flatten it out and then come and cut it the next day.
What's going on? Maybe undo the oil and just see if there's any fragment. Come here, man. Good. It was just, you were getting the little bit of play, and it's a 151. It's going to have some play. I just yeah. wanted to make sure before I get too far involved. <laughs> okay, so what's been happening here, Stan? Yeah. You're adjusting your lock nut is loose. Yes, and you go in with the big long one. No, 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 it was loose. Like, I don't know how much tension I'm putting on it because I can't loosen that nut. Oh, maybe I see. I, go, go, go grab a 13 mil out of there, Stan. See if that's a... Oh, I got it now. Never mind. Yeah, when you backed it up, that should have loosened that nut, the lock nut. Right? Yeah, there we go. There we go. The idea is to... Yeah, go in and tighten it a bit. Jiggle that clutch back and forth. I want to take it off just because it's easier. Because you, you, you don't want any pressure on the on the uh, drive line yeah. when you're because you don't know what you're doing. <laughs> you know you don't know if it's tight or loose or where it's at, right? Yeah. I have at least an inch forward and back there. Is that more? Feels like more. Should be. Just yeah. loosened it right off. So that is. Oh, hold on. There's, there's, there's a lot of play. Play. These, you know, chain cases, eh? But you gotta, you got, you like go home and then uh, adjust it. Now I would even look up the manual and see what it says to adjust it. I tightened it and backed it off. I tightened it and backed it off like half a turn or okay. quarter turn. Oh, I still got an inch of movement there for sure. But well, better than it was. Do it again. Yeah, okay, so there's there's movement in, there's a coupler shaft right there. Yeah. There's movement in that. Okay. So there's movement in everything from there to there. Okay. So that's part of it. So that shaft is worn. Yeah, but you don't have to do anything with it. It'll last forever. He, um, like I say, he redid the engine. He showed me pictures. Okay. Now, so, now that, good. sorry, just, sorry, Go I'm ahead. telling you. Go ahead. The lock nut is not locked. It's just by hand. Okay. So by the time we get back and you get home, you got to tighten the lock nut. Or, you know, go through it and then see what you can do for the adjustment on it. Okay. Was it tighter? Hard to tell, eh? Hard to tell. I know that it's tighter than what it was. I guarantee it, you that. Honestly, it, it was more sloppy than it was before we did that. Like, oh. when I came here, it wasn't that sloppy. Back and forth. Well, that, that, that groomer will lose some things. <laughs>